Luo Sifen, a kind of pungent but addictive snack from southwestern China, has become a must-buy at the Wutong Dock of Xiamen. Most buyers are from Jinmen and Taiwan. They say the food is banned in the region because of the local authorities' overreaction to a company's advertising slogan, "You're my people." Such bittersweet exchanges would not happen if the direct sea links between Xiamen and Jinmen did not open. Before the opening of the line, people from Jinmen had to detour to Japan or Hong Kong to enter Xiamen. I'm here at Xiamen's Heping Dock. In 2001, the Taiwu ferry arrived here from Taiwan with more than a hundred of people on board, marking the opening of the first direct passenger service across the Taiwan Straits. People are breathtaking, hoping for a crowd of Jinmen friends to appear on the sea floor. The opening of the route took many years of officials from both sides. Everything was unprecedented and had political risks. If you speak from a historical point of view, the opening of the line took us 52 years. Zhang Baowei was one of the pioneers to open the line. With special approval from authorities, he always traveled directly between Xiamen and Jinmen for his work. The efficiency made him believe that he should help to broaden this convenience to ordinary people. I got the idea when I dealt with the repatriate cases between the mainland and Taiwan. I was able to privately bring the younger brother of the deputy director of Jinmen County from Xiamen to Jinmen. I then reported to my boss. I said we should boost the exchanges on the people-to-people level. After the reform and opening up, we have created many benefits for people on both sides. However, it wouldn't work without direct travel between Xiamen and Jinmen. Though it was complicated, the idea was still pursued. Ma Jilie was involved in the negotiations with Taiwan authorities. Wu Chengdian, 当时带来的签字币签完，就留证给我做纪念。这个啊，这个就是我说我保留起来了。我当时就这样放在我们局里面的信封里面，就这样。那么跟台湾之间谈这个东西。The negotiations with Taiwan were very politically sensitive. The certificates of cabin crews, what kind of flags do we use for the navigation, the registration of the ferries, all this should be crystal clear in the agreement. The opening of the direct passenger service is followed by other direct sea and air routes between Taiwan and the mainland. Cross-strait interaction has since become frequent. Because I. I love my job. I love working on the affairs concerning Taiwan. Even when I was a soldier, I wanted to contribute to peaceful reunification. The Xiamen Jinmen Sea Link is allowing more than six thousand people to travel back and forth every day. The fruit of the labor of the older generation is not only kept, but it's being reinforced. Bo Siren, CGTN, Xiamen, Fujian Province.